First off, Mosley Music does not, does not leak music. That is not our style. We do not leak music. It hurts us to leak music. Even with me being Tim's official DJ and a and r for the company, I still hate the fact that when I get music, that I have it. But never, ever, ever, ever will I leak music or anybody from Mosley Music will leak music. Hold on. Stop typing for a second. Stop typing for a second. Hear me out. Then I'm going to answer all your questions because I'm not looking at the screen or not for your questions. Just give me a second. As for Tim, Tim is upset that the music is being leaked. The whole crew is upset that it's being leaked. Now, somebody said, well, Free, you know, you can look at it two ways. One, you know, they leaking all the Tim records and, you know, the radio is going crazy or some of the fans are going crazy, yada, 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 yada. Yeah, yeah, whatever. But on the flip side of it, it makes us as a company look real bad. And even though we had nothing to do with it, it still looks suspicious. Like, dang, why is all the Timberland records being leaked? And more importantly, it comes back people looking at me as being the DJ, like I'm leaking the freaking records. And I ain't leaking nothing. I don't have to leak anything. There's always one thing that I live by since I've been DJing, and that's loyalty. I'm too loyal to go and screw something up. Another word I live by since I've been DJing is trust. I, I know too much. I've seen too much. I've heard too much by being around Tim, being around Jay, being around Puff, being around Luke, being around any and every celebrity you may think about that I've been around for me to go out and run my mouth. That's not what I do. That's not my business. That's why I can go and be around these people and they don't have to worry about their business being out in the streets. When it comes to leaking records, it hurts the artists. It's a trickle down effect. One, because if I spend if I'm if I spend my hard earned money in on going into the studio, because I gotta pay the studio, I gotta pay the engineer, I gotta pay the producer, you know, to create some a masterpiece or create some art for fans, for the music population, the whole generation in 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 in, in, in a whole and for somebody to go and leak, somebody to go and hack into my computer or hack into the into the uh, studio's computer and leak my music to the masses, it's not even ready. Half of the songs, all of the songs that I leaked, they're not even finished. Those are not even the right versions of the records. But it makes it look bad. Like, it looks real bad on us. You know what I'm saying? Especially me being the DJ. It looks crazy. Like, now nah, Jay may look at me sideways like, I, I leaked the music. And I know damn well I didn't leak nothing. And all the opportunities I had to play records for people, I didn't play anything for them. Nothing. Even when I had a girlfriend, she didn't even get the opportunity to hear none of the music when I was given the music. Because that's not her business. You know what I mean? So, I just wanted to clear the air. Yeah, I spoke to Tim. I spoke to my manager. I spoke to Tim again. And Tim wanted me to Tim wanted me to say this. Mosley music does not leak music. He feels bad for Jay that the music has leaked. Straight up. He feels bad. I feel bad. My whole camp feels bad that the music has been leaked. You know what I mean? So I had to get that off of my chest. I had to say that. I had to come live and say that. Because now with all of the leaks being out. It looks crazy when I go to the studio tonight and have a webcam on with Tim on it. It's going to look crazy. So I think I might hold back a little bit from putting Tim on because there's a, you know, aside from the music being leaked, there are a lot of people that come on here just to hate. And it's cool. Everybody have their own opinion. And I don't have a problem with people's opinion. But what I do have a problem with is making me look bad. And I would not put anybody in the position to be made a fool of because of me. I love coming on here. I love interacting with the fans or the friends or whatever you want to call it. I call myself a normal dude. I don't look at myself as a celebrity. I'm a normal dude. You know what I'm saying? I put my pants on like everybody else. But 
when I'm in, when I enjoy doing something and then I invite somebody else or one of my close friends into something that I'm doing and then I get people on here who act stupid who may say the wrong things or you know say something derogatory whatever that's your opinion that's cool but when you come on to you know I wouldn't come into your room and disrespect your guests like that's to me that's that's immature that's childish if you got a good good question to ask fine ask all the questions you want to ask if he wants to answer them no problem it's cool it's cool. He can answer whatever question you want to ask, but when you get dumb questions, is what really becomes a turnoff. You know what I mean? So all I'm saying is, mostly music. We did not have anything to do with leaking records. Freestyle Steve Timberland's DJ had nothing to do with leaking any of the Blueprint Three records. Period. 